Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is Audacity. Uh, da, 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 about Audacity 1.38. If you're doing any kind of transcription, uh, this is a pretty cool tool to do it. It's not great, it's not 100%, but it's pretty good. Let me show you how I use it, and you can make your own estimations. So I've got this audio file. I'm going to play it. Now, what I just tried to do is hit the space bar. Now, the space bar doesn't automatically, because I was in the label track, uh, it added another space to my text track, which is not what I want. So, there's a bit of mousing that I don't like. I need to set my hotkeys <coughs> to go between my audio and my uh, my audio and my text. Now, if I space bar again, okay, so now the that bar is not moving either so that's something that I struggle with again um, it's it's audacity is not designed as a text or a transcription tool but it does have some niceties like this uh, redesign t-shirts so oh, see this now I gotta drag that down so that they can be used as uh, handbags, I believe, is what I said. So let's go. Now I save that. Yeah, okay. Now I've saved it. I'm going to put it in onto the desktop when it loads. It's really slow. Why is it so slow? Hmm, I've never seen it do that before. I don't know why it's being so temperamental. It doesn't look like it likes something. Well, um, hmm, maybe this is a bug, more of a bug report for Audacity than a way to show how Audacity could be used in um, for transcription.